Welcome back to the 75 gallon mixed reef aquarium and just doing a quick update. Doc is doing well and I've tested the parameters and I'll put the results in the description down below. And fish are doing good, corals are doing well. Need to do probably a part three on the bubble algae just to stay on top of that and then I am going to pick up at least one emerald crab perhaps two and give them a try in the reef tank um, the sun coral it's not doing well. The torches still needs to be mounted and the water is looking good. It's crystal clear. Uh, I am in the process of putting uh, the Nopox by Red Sea on the doser um, so that it will dose the tank automatically. Um, I was reading online, I believe, <clears throat> from what I've read. Not sure if it's true or not, but we're gonna give it a try. Uh, the best time to dose Nopox is about an hour to two hours, three hours into the beginning of the photo period. Um, so we'll see how much truth is to that or if it even matters. Um, the torch, especially the green one, seems to be opening a lot more now that it's in this position so there's the green finger letter core uh, we have the rainbow rescue core that's still in the shadows back there but it is doing better each day and then the torch um, is doing well so The main thing is I am selling my Neptune Apex. Actually, it's already sold. By the end of this video, it probably would have been already sold. Um, it is the Apex Light, which is a, they no longer make this model. Um, it's under the classic umbrella. Um, and so I'm looking forward to upgrading different brand controller in the interim and so I am pulling um, and then the, the display is not powering on so I won't I won't be sending that um, to the person who purchased it but because that's not working but the um, all the other pieces are powering up um, so we have the PM1 module uh, we have two temperature Probes. Um, I will be sending two lab grade pH probes, uh, two NNG bar apes, and then a bunch of cords and some Cat5. Um, and the biggest difference with this version um, is that it does not have the VDM ports uh, for lights. Um, so it worked well for me in the time that I had it. Um, it was kind of underused because I was mainly using it to monitor um, my tanks instead of actually control and run them so it was um, one NG bar 8 was running the freshwater tank and then the other one was on the saltwater tank so when I upgrade I will have it fully 100% on the saltwater tank and um, yeah I'll just do videos from here so I have a 10 gallon auto top off and then the tank with Seachem uh, 2 part refusion 26 milliliters Monday, Wednesday and Fridays and the caulk washer dose 24 seven and it's every other half hour for 30 minutes it drips into the tank which comes almost to 800 milliliters which is slightly underdosing. I could probably put a lot more, um, but the auto top off.
Thanks for watching. Welcome new subscribers and stay tuned for more updates.